welcome back to my channel. My name's Abby, and today I'm back for another What I Eat in a Day video. Um, I'm also going to have a grocery haul for you today. I have a Walmart pickup to go get later. Today is Sunday. Just a quick like recap of the last week. I have not been doing that great um, eating-wise. Done okay, but not really not that great. Um, I worked out three days this last week, and I don't know. Honestly, I've just been feeling kind of blah. I think I'm still just getting back into my routine. I don't know. I just was not feeling it this week at all. I put on a couple more pounds on top of what I already gained from like Disney and Marco Island. So I don't know. I just feel a little defeated. Well, I was feeling defeated yesterday. Today I'm feeling better. Like I got up, I went for a walk. I have about 5,000 steps in already. It's not even 8.30 yet. So I'm feeling much better today, but like mostly this whole entire week, I've just been feeling really like down and just not that great so um yeah that's that's basically the recap i'm just gonna get right back into it today and try to have a better day today and a better week so hopefully that will happen um but i am going to make myself some breakfast so i'll show you what that is and then um after i eat that i am going to do i have to read my daily bible reading and i also have to read for my bible study today we're studying the book of daniel so i have to read a little bit of that and then i'm gonna go <clears throat> Get ready for church and yeah so i'm gonna make my breakfast and show you that Alrighty, here is breakfast today i'm doing peanut butter and jelly toast so this is i have some of that dave's killer bread in the fridge so i use two slices of that with some jiff crunchy and smucker's natural strawberry and then i'm doing some yogurt i don't know i just really feel like loading up for breakfast today so that is what i'm doing um i'm gonna go get done what i need to get done and then i'll catch up with you in a bit bye Hey guys, I am all ready for church. I don't know if you can see that. Thought I'd show you my outfit. I don't know why. Um, headed there now. I'm taking this with me right after church. I have Bible study. So I'm going to take this with me in case I get hungry. Um, I did not finish my breakfast. I feel like I should have only made one piece of toast. Um, because I didn't finish the yogurt and I didn't finish the second piece of toast. I'm just trying to like listen to my body, be mindful, and not feel like I have to finish it if I'm not hungry. So I didn't. But yeah, I gotta go. Um, I will catch up with you when I get back. My grocery pickup's right after church. So when I get back, you'll get to see all my groceries. Alrighty, friends. It is like 1.20. I am just back from getting my groceries. So let me show you what all I got. Okay, so first I just got some more sunscreen. I always use this Neutrogena. Typically I get 70 SPF, but they didn't have that, so I just went with a 100. This stuff smells really, really good. really like it. It's not very, like, chemical-y. It just has a really good scent. And I just got some air fresheners. I really like this scent as well. Um, I got some eggs. Let's open them and see if they are good. They all look good to me. Then I got some bagels. I just got the lenders kind. I just got everything at Walmart. I did not feel like going to different stores. I usually get different bagels at Giant Eagle that are less calories, but I just went with these ones. It was just easier. I got Sara Lee butter bread. They were out of Nature's Own butter bread, so they substituted it for the Sara Lee. So we'll try that, see if it's any good. I got some more milk chocolate chips for my pancakes in the morning. And I got some frozen corn just to have with meals. I got some um, sausage patties to have for breakfast. I got some meatballs. Um, I got some corn dogs. I don't know, just craving corn dogs. So went with the great value. I've never tried those kind before, so we'll see if they're good. Um, I got some more bomb pops. I buy these for the daycare kiddos. Since summer, I like to give them a sweet treat every once in a while. And then I got these strawberry shortcake popsicles. Well, they're not really popsicles, but I got these just for myself. I probably will not share those with the kiddos because I like them too much. Um, I got a rotisserie chicken. It's just a cold one that it was probably from yesterday that they sell them cheaper for um, when they're cold. The Walmart grocery app I found does not let you pick up the hot ones, so I don't know. I got some of these Idaho potatoes. I wanted to try them. I've never tried them before. Thought it'd be good maybe to have some like chicken, potatoes, and corn. Um, I don't know, one night for dinner. I got some of this Dove milk chocolate to have for my lunch dessert. I haven't had the Dove in a while. They were out of peanut butter, which I was super sad about. Um, I got these Kodiak waffle pancake mix. You know, I have these like all the time. But this is what I use whenever I make my pancakes in the morning. As you can see, like half a cup is what I typically use. And it has 14 grams of protein. So super good. Um, I got some green beans just to have it for sides. I got cheese curls bananas 
angel hair pasta i've just kind of been craving like spaghetti and meatballs um so see i might have that for dinner or something else i'm not sure and then we just got some nutella and marshmallow cream i thought that'd be good to have on graham crackers for a snack and then i decided to go with grape drink flavoring to have with my collagen I've never tried grape before, so I think I'm going to try that later to see how I like it. So that's everything I got. Um, I'm going to put all this away, change my clothes, make myself some lunch, and then I'll show you what I'm having to actually eat for lunch. All right, guys, here is what's up for lunch today. So I made one of those corn dogs. I'm going to have some strawberries, some cheese curls, a little chocolate for dessert, and then I have half of this Alani. I drank half yesterday. I'm going to drink half today. Just, you know, I need the energy to be productive. So this is what I'm going to have. I'm going to go relax for a bit, and then... I'll catch you with you later. Hey guys, so I'm about to try this grape drink flavoring with my collagen drink. So if you're new here, I typically, um, some point in the day, drink collagen. So I do water. I just like fill this up, whatever, with water. You can do 8 to 16 ounces. And then I add a scoop of this um, Alani New Collagen. And I just put a couple um, squirts of this drink flavoring in. Now I was fully expecting this drink flavoring to be purple but it's not because it's called Simply Clear. So I'm guessing it doesn't have any like dyes or anything in it, which is good. Um, so it looks like a little off-whitish from the collagen, but this is my first time trying grape. It smells a little grapey. Okay, here we go. It's not bad. I'm gonna put like one more squirt in. I did two, it's okay. Let's shake that up. It's not bad. I'm not like really getting grape vibes from it though. It just kind of tastes fruity, but it's probably good. I don't love like the artificial grape flavor. So not bad. I'll keep it around. Now I haven't taken my greens on screen for you in forever i used to get on my instagram like every morning and like take my greens to a song on my instagram stories but i haven't done that in forever either i don't know i just felt like nobody cared and it was stupid but this is the greens i take they're my adventure to fit i do one scoop a day it helps um just give me the nutrients i would need for fruit from fruits and vegetables that i don't always eat i typically do pretty well with fruit it's the veggies that but I don't do super well with, but I don't care because I don't really like them that much. But I think I'm gonna have some with dinner. Um, so here we go. Scoop it, shoot it, and go. Mm. FYI, don't try to talk. With greens in your mouth, I tried to tell you to drink. So you just drink it, swoosh it around, and that's it. But it's about 3.30. I'm going to sip on this drink a little bit. Do I want a snack? I don't know. Nah. I think I'm good. Typically, like, I feel like if I would have a snack with this, I don't always have a snack with my collagen drink, um, but it would be something salty. And I already had cheese curls with lunch, and I don't really have anything else that I want. So I'm just going to drink this, and then I'll have dinner in, like, probably two hours or so. Um, I've been re-watching This Is Us. So I just watched the finale last week. Um, my grandma and I watched This Is Us together. So we missed a week because I was at Disney, and then the following week, we just didn't have time to watch it. So we watched both episodes on Wednesday, I think. Um last wednesday it was just a really good finale they always throw a twist in at the end like they've always seemed to fast forward to the future a little bit and then like there's this twist i'm not going to say what it is in case anybody i don't want to spoil anything for people that haven't seen it but man they always do that to you on that show um and i think next season season six and i'm pretty sure i read somewhere it's going to be the last season but i just started feeling like nostalgic and i was like i'm gonna go rewatch this is us from the first season so that's what I'm doing and then I'm just like getting like I normally do just get some cleaning stuff done in between watching the show so yeah I'm gonna go just go relax and I will pop back on here in a bit hello um I'm making dinner it's like 5 15 right now um but it's not gonna be ready for a while so I made myself a snack 
I can't remember. Did I tell you guys I was making salmon for dinner? I can't remember if I actually said that, but in my head, most of the day, I was going to make salmon for dinner. But guess what? I don't want salmon. I want spaghetti and meatballs, so that's what I'm doing. Um, basically, I threw the sauce jar away. Hold on. Um, I'm using this vodka sauce. I think this is only like local to where I live. Um, so, uh, it, but this is what it's called. So you're probably not gonna find it at your grocery store. But it's just vodka sauce. I'm sure y'all have vodka sauce. Um, and the meatballs from the grocery haul and the angel hair pasta from the grocery haul. So I am um, cooking, I'm cooking the meatballs. I just dumped all the sauce. In this pot and they're supposed to cook for like 25 minutes and then i have water boiling for the noodles why does water take so long to boil so i'm, I'm making that but while i'm making that i just really want a snack so here's what i'm doing all right so we're going to make a nutella marshmallow fluff sandwich so you take one graham cracker break it in half on one side put some nutella other side you put marshmallow cream and then you just bloop make it into a little sandwich and there there it is it's so good i did a nutella and peanut butter one i think in my last video did i film that let me know if i filmed that because i don't remember um but then i was like you know it would be really good marshmallow fluff and nutella so let's try it it's gonna squeeze out everywhere i know it mm. that is good Thumbs up. Look, guys, you can see my water bottle collection up there. My camera lives in this cabinet, so that's why it's almost always open when I'm filming, like if you see it in the background. But up top, I can't figure out how to move my finger. I keep all my water bottles. Um, I need to rearrange. <laughs> I need to, like, rearrange this cabinet. I need to rearrange this stuff down here. Um, I really need to, like, do something with this cabinet here. These are just like a bunch of random snacks that I never I never eat anymore, guys. I got tired of Alani bars. I got tired of like, I bought these forever ago. I got tired of those. Um, I got tired of this oatmeal, but I don't want to throw it away because that's really wasteful. Um, I know I ate it. I did eat um, a Alani bar at church this morning um, at Bible study, but I only ate half of it. I don't know, they just aren't doing it for me as much anymore. Um, so I need to figure out what to do with all that stuff. Chatham likes so maybe I'll give him to Chatham. I'll let Chatham come read my cupboard and take what she wants. Um, this really needs organized. Do you guys want, would you guys watch a video if I organize things? Um, I have a, I have a cabinet out here. Let me show you. Um, this is like, I have this doorway. Okay, it's a mess. Don't judge me. It goes to my backyard. And then anytime I get like Amazon boxes or like, you see, I have some Milani boxes there. Just throw the boxes in there, and then eventually I will break them down and stick them in a garbage bag. You want to know the story about this garbage bag? It's been sitting here for months. Because one night I was dragging that garbage bag out to the curb, and I lost my keys. And they might be in that garbage bag. I have the other set. So I've just been using that, and I've been too lazy to go through that bag. But I need to go through that bag, take everything out, and see if my keys... Are in that garbage bag like i'm telling you it's probably been six months since i lost my other set of keys so i have like two, i have two like lock it's like the lock unlock and it has the key attached to it i have and i had another one of those so i'm using that and i also have just like a manual key for my car so i still have like two keys for my car but that bag's just sitting there because i don't feel like going through it one day i will um but i have these cabinets here in this little room where I just store like extra toilet paper, garbage bags. I have like a box of chalk down there for the kids. Like just, just random stuff. And it used to be kind of organized, but it just got away from me. The other side just has more. You can't really see very well. Just, just stuff. And I need to reorganize it. So would you want to watch a video of me organizing things? Yes? No? Tell me down below probably will do it anyways but um i'm like struggling like i'm like already thinking ahead to when my disney vlogs are done and i want to give you guys like different content i don't want to just keep doing what i eat in a days all the time um 
So let me know, like, what do you guys want to see? I'm going to do, I'm going to, at some point, probably July, do a grocery haul video where I actually film in the store and take you there with me. Um, so I think I'm going to do that at one point. Organizing. Maybe some more recipes. I don't know, but late, like, give me some ideas down below. It doesn't have to be food related or weight loss related. It can be like anything. I'm called Abby C Adventures. We can go on any kind of adventure as you want. Just tell me. Um, I don't know. Yeah. That's just, I just needed to get that off my head. Also, while I'm just sitting here talking, I think I've decided I am going to not weigh myself for a while. I just want to take the pressure of the scale away for, I think I'm going to go try for a month just see how I do and in one month I will get back on the scale and just just see what see what it says and I actually I actually already put it away so I guess I already decided but I could just get it back out very easily I think I just need to take the pressure of the scale away for a little bit and focus on eating more intuitively more mindfully without restrictions I don't know the proper term I might I've watched some intuitive eating videos and I probably was intuitively eating wrong because i was still worried about weight loss because apparently you're not supposed to worry about weight loss with intuitive eating but i'm mostly just i don't know how else to say it. like i just want to eat what i feel like eating mindfully like without restrictions but i still i still need to lose some weight um but i'm just tired of i'm tired of tracking i'm just tired of it so i want to do it in a way where i can lose weight so that's what we're gonna do so i would do like a monthly weigh-in update we're gonna see how this next couple weeks go um but that's my plan. I need to learn how to stop saying like and um a lot in my videos as well. <sighs> All right, I'm going to go finish this snack, stir my meatballs and my noodles. So I will be back once dinner is all ready. All righty, here it is. I'll put together noodles. I did four meatballs and then the sauce. I'll be back later. Bye. Alrighty guys, I am gonna end my night. It's like 20 to 7, but I really want my dessert now. I'm gonna eat one of these um strawberry ice cream bars. Um I just wanna say like I know today, you know, I maybe didn't have a lot of fruits, vegetables, whatever, but I am really, really trying to figure out how to truly intuitively eat. This is just what I'm gonna do for now. I'm playing around with things and just trying to find a healthy balance mentally and this is how i'm gonna do it i just kind of feel like i'm at a little bit of a roadblock lately and just something i need to push past and i feel this is the way to do it i'm gonna go now but if you did enjoy this video please give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below don't forget to let me know like ideas for videos you guys want um want to see like what would you truly be interested in watching um for a while we'll have disney's every saturday for the next several weeks and wednesdays are going to be mostly what i eat in a day i might throw in something different here and there but that's what you have to look forward to don't forget to come find me on instagram press that subscribe button if you haven't already and yeah i will see you guys next time hope you have a great day bye oh next this saturday Disney, Magic Kingdom, part two, posted part one this past Saturday, so go watch those. Bye.